Alright people, as you can see, I'm listening to that good old, good old, good old, good old, good old, I can't think of the name right now, cause I'm a little, I'm a little excited, you know, it's Friday, cause I get two Fridays, I'm not like everybody else, you know, I work 10 hour shifts and shit, I'm a working man, blue collar and shit, but uh, yeah, I'm, besides being hella vulgar, um, I guess what? I guess what? Well, let's see. Let's see. What's, what's an oppression issue? I guess. Let's just say making stupid decisions and realizing that what you got is better than what you think. Honestly, the grass usually ain't green. Shit is usually worse, but not everybody realizes that. Then you got the people who just don't know how or live in fear. I mean, at this point, the way the things are going in this world, you might as well do what the fuck you want to. Because... You never know, you might be going to Walmart to go get a fucking gallon of milk and fucking, I don't know, middle class American white kid just decides to blam the whole fucking store, like, it's crazy, like, shit be fucked up, like, not even up front, I, I had something going on, and like, my perspective on a lot of things have changed, like, as far as, where am I going? As far as inner, inner perspective, a lot, of, a lot of aspects of my life needed to change because I've been living in a, in a, in a, in a, in a state of denial and uh, it ain't gonna fix shit, you know? I can pretend and all that good shit, but at the end of the day, I know what's real. You know what's real. It's all in my face. I ain't good with that shit. You know me. My facial expressions will tell you more. More than anything. But I don't know. I, I just kind of. I just been kind of. This shit been on my mind for the most part. I just been like avoiding the subject. But you know. Uh, it's just been something. Something life changing. Like I, I've never, I, I can say I've never had something like this happen and make me reevaluate myself and what the fuck I was doing and where I was at. But hey, life is a big ass lesson, ain't it? You know, you learn your lessons, you free from your mistakes, and you be a better version of yourself tomorrow because can't change the past, and we don't live in the future, so we gotta make the most of today, regardless of what's going on, so, but, you know, we're listening to some good old dip set, we're just gonna let the iPod rock, so, don't be a, don't be a surprise if it gets a little savage with the video game music and all that shit, you know, I'm an equal opportunist, I, I, I just love music, Music is where it's at, you know, because it just, I don't know, expresses, it's beautiful, it expresses, it expresses something beautiful, regardless if it's talking about fucking bitches on the dance floor at three in the morning, if you can rock to it, it pulls an emotion, so it's beautiful, it's art, like, like any, any other piece of art, you know, you should should look at it, appreciate what you get, because it could be a musicless world, you know, so, that would be pretty whack on car rides, nobody wants to play, uh, <laughs> I Spy for 20, for 20 hours on the road, he'd have strangled some goddamn body, I Spy my hands on your neck, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm kind of
kind of lit. I'm lit. I'm fucked up. Like, I'm not even. <laughs> nah, I ain't even gonna do that. <laughs> That'd be too savage. Oh. I'm not even lit. I'm not even. My nigga. I'm three light beers in, and I'm lit. So. It's Friday, nigga. Yeah. Just running around talking shit. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Yeah, I know it's not Friday. It's Thursday, but I got two Fridays. Thursday's my Friday, nigga. Ha <laughs> ha. I don't gotta work. You know, no more complaints about how fucking boring it is, cause it work is hella boring. Ten hours of not doing shit. I think I I probably work a solid hour. But I'm I'm 10 hours and I'm making pretty damn good money, so I can't really complain, but I'm a hands-on man. If I can't do nothing myself, it kinda makes me like powerless. So I'm like, hey, let me get my hands on it. Let me visualize, let me make the most of it. Shit, as of late, it hasn't even been that. I've been so fucking Somewhere that just kind of just kind of like fell off. My third eye started closing. A lot of shit started to niggas can't drive blood. Why that motherfucker at the light just sit there for like I don't know half the green light. And I'm coming up on him, and I see him sitting there. I guess somebody's more lit than I am. Ha! Ah, but uh, don't tell nobody, because I am definitely not driving. Allegedly. <laughs> There's that word again, allegedly. Allegedly will let you get away with the most vilest acts as long as you got allegedly. Allegedly... Like, God damn, the dirt is what is savage, so. <laughs> allegedly, that's how you cover your ass if you're a criminal. Put the word ale- allegedly. Some people, some people, some people may have imagined they seen what they seen, but nah. <laughs> oh, damn. All I see is blues and cops. Somebody shit getting kicked in. Watch your doors out there, America. These cops ain't playing fair. They kicking niggas' doors in and shit. So, yeah. Um, I guess what? What? We'll talk about. Ah, uh, wait. Hey, the chemist playing. You know, if you know him, cool. If you don't know him, you better get to know him, nigga. That's the truth right there. But I'm about to change songs because I need some words or something. I need some distraction because I'm getting bored as I'm driving. And I'm, it's not good. And I drive a stick. That's right, girl. I know how to work that clutch. I know you like that shit. Ah. I'm fucking just tripping on this goddamn camera. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Um, so I, I guess I, I gotta get into something new. I, I've been thinking like music or, or like maybe fucking kayaking or some shit or fucking biking or something. I need a hobby. I can't just get up, go to work, fucking not do nothing. I'm trying to get some, uh, some me time because, uh, working fucking... 10 hours a day and only sleeping for 5 hours a night that shit is like weak sauce I need some r and R. I I need some casino gambling some some fucking skydiving some uh, I, I, I don't know something to vent how mad I was that this motherfucker said he was the king shit and I couldn't say too much cause he's the boss punk ass bitch even though that ain't happened today might have happened in a previous incident but you know the punk ass bitch part was just for the future reference you know for when i when i do say it, you little punk ass bitch but anyway um let's 
see, let's see, let's see. What's something good to talk about? Uh, I guess we will talk about how how lit I am. <laughs> yes, people. I'm fucking lit. I'm lit. Very lit. And like shit is like that. I wish I had a, a fucking co star or something. Like, I need motherfuckers to ride. Like, if you were trying to ride in this truck and blog with a real nigga, yes, I said it, real nigga. Because I got real nigga problems, you know. Holla at me. Just link. And we'll talk about whatever the fuck you bring up or what, however many people we see walking down the street because. People watching, oh, best believe me, it's amazing, people. I've been doing it for the last couple days at work. Yes, I really don't do shit. So, trust me, people watching is the shit. People do very awkward shit when you're not watching. People can't read signs. Apparently, they can't walk because motherfuckers was tripping over some rubber strips on the sidewalk. Pick your fucking feet up. Why are you dragging your feet? A nigga, your shoes got sole. You try to scratch the sole off? You a soulless motherfucker. That's what that is. That's what. That's all them sins. You walking for your sins, scratching at your souls. <laughs> but uh, yeah. Uh, I just, I got out of class. I'm doing my fucking. Thinking about a suction cup on the glass and just point, but uh, yeah, I don't know how I feel about that. I think I, I think I'm gonna do my, my broadcast like this from now on. You're not really gonna see me when I get the rig up. I'll probably put it up, you know, out facing the traffic so you can understand when I have my moments of snap happy rage and it's kind of like unseen. So. You know, because everybody in Virginia's got their license from a Cracker Jack box, and apparently niggas don't see a two-way street. Yes, that just happened. Motherfuckers don't know what a two-way street is, and sitting in the middle of it is like, I guess, the the best option because fucking nobody else needs to go the other way and get past me. You know, obviously, because this is my fucking road, but any fucking way inconsiderate motherfuckers but then again i'm talking <laughs> i'm not inconsiderate i'm just i'm just a lost lost individual doing lost people things doing dumb shit making dumb decisions you know living life and having regrets <laughs> but I guess that's the end of this because I can't really talk anymore because I'm lit and I got to pee like a racehorse. Gotta go.